Hey everybody, this is Chad from LinnandChad.com and today we're going to go over customizing a brand new WordPress installation by changing the title, the tagline, and adding a theme so the blog will really say a lot about who you are and what you want to do. First thing you want to do is log into your WordPress dashboard, come under the Appearance tab, and click on Themes. This is going to allow you to choose a theme to make your blog look the way you want. Now, to add new themes, simply click the Add New Themes link and that will bring you to the Install Themes page. The first choice you have is to simply do a search on this page. You can type in search terms for the type of theme you want, or you can just check off different options. For example, if you wanted a green theme with two columns, you would check those off. You can choose as many things as you want. Click on Find Themes, and it'll do a quick search for you in the WordPress Themes directory and show you all the themes that apply. Scroll through, look for a theme that looks nice. You can check out the little descriptions. And if you find one that looks cool, you can click Preview, and it will pull up a little preview window. And you can actually scroll through here and navigate this as if it were an actual blog. It will show you all the different things like headings and paragraphs, lists, pretty much anything you would put on your blog anyway. You can see how it will look with this theme. So you really know what you're getting yourself into before you go choosing something. You can visit pages to see what pages look like. Like I said, this works like a regular blog. It's just all set up as a preview for you. Once you decide you have a theme you like, you can close the preview window. Click the install link, brings up the install button where you can click cancel or install now. When you click install now, it goes through real quick, unpacks it, installs it, tells you when it was successfully installed. Then you can click to activate it if you want, and that theme is immediately activated. It becomes your current theme. Down here you'll see all your other available themes. If you ever want to preview or activate one of those, you can do that with any of these links. Once you've activated a new theme, refresh your blog. And the new theme immediately takes over. All of your content is going to be exactly the same. All of your posts, all the anything you've typed into your pages, all the, the media and pictures you've uploaded, that all stays the same. Themes don't change that, just changes the way it all looks to your to your viewers. Choosing a good theme makes your blog look the way you want so you know your readers are going to enjoy visiting your page. Now, the next thing we're going to change is the title and tagline of your blog because I'm guessing you want something a little more intriguing than what you have right now. To do that, you're going to go back to your dashboard, you're going to look under Settings, click on General. This is the page where you can change the basic options for your blog. First thing you're going to do is change the blog title to whatever you want it to be, whatever you want your blog to be named. We're going to go with Then you can also change the tagline, which is just a brief description of what your blog is about. It's kind of like a subtitle or subheadline. So, change those to affect the title and tagline of your blog. You can also go through this page and change some other basic settings like your email address for notifications. Um, you can change the date and time format to see how they're displayed change the time zone you're in so that the time you post things is accurate. When you're all done with those, you click Save Changes. You go over to your blog, refresh it, and those changes will immediately take effect. Now, the other way that you can add a theme is let's say you find a theme you like, but you didn't find it by doing the search we just did. You found it while you were out searching the internet, and it just happened to be a theme that had a download link, and you downloaded it to your computer question is now how do you get that theme from your computer onto your blog? Very easy. You just go to Add New Themes and as opposed to doing a search like we did before, you're going to click this Upload link right here. That's going to allow you to browse your computer. When you download a theme, it's going to be in zip format, which is exactly what you want. You click Browse. Now I have a theme saved on my desktop for this example. So I'll go to my desktop. This theme is called Fusion, so I'll open a Fusion, click Install Now. Now it's going to unpack that zip file and install the theme to my blog for me. It doesn't activate it automatically, you have to click an Activate link once it's done. Now it tells me that it's been unpacked and installed successfully. You can preview it or activate it or just reactivate it or just return to the themes page. You'll see that Fusion, that new theme that I was just talking about, is one of my available themes. I can activate that theme just like I did before. And that theme has come from my computer onto my blog and it's now been activated. 
And again, this won't change any of my content. It'll just change the way everything displays. So that's how you take your fresh, brand new WordPress installation and turn it into your very own blog. Now all you have to do is start creating some content, writing some posts, and uh, sharing it with the world. Enjoy.